A young life lost. This is after a failed attempt to steal Zeskokopa cables at Olympia substation in Lusaka. The boy, who is believed to have been working in the company of his friends, was then abandoned after he met his fate. This incident has saddened the community and the local leadership. What is highly urbanized and uh, we rarely, rarely experience such occurrences. So for me, I would say this is unfortunate and uh, I can just sympathize with uh, the soul that has been lost. However, I, can I want to assure the people of Olympia, Olympia Market, where economic activity is happening, that uh, they should bear with us. We have seen where the problem has come from. Zesco Public Relations Manager Hazel Zulu says the incident has also caused a complete blackout for the entire Olympia area. Because we have at least um, in excess of 300 customers being out of supply. So uh, we are very saddened as a corporation. And we just want to make a passionate appeal to the public that these vandals are coming from the communities where we live. And we know them. So let's guard these installations jealously. These are public installations. This is what we are consistently talking about, that vandalism is a crime. It's not only a crime in terms of uh, breaking the law, but it also can amount to loss of lives. Zesco says it has lost in excess of 80,000 kwacha because of this case of vandalism. Kasabula Mchimba, ZNBC News in Lusaka. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe.